Hi, Ollie again from Milk and Honey. Uh, so for the signature, I'm going to be making you one that's on our menu called the Choker. Uh, now, the Choker was first printed in, I believe, uh, in the Savoy in 1930. Um, and it's, it's kind of different to the one we make today, as, I mean, a lot of the drinks in the Savoy should be, because they're not all amazing the way that they're printed. So for this Choker, uh, originally it was four glasses of whiskey, two glasses of absinthe, and two dashes of absinthe bitters, um, which is pretty fantastic. I mean, um, there's a little quote on the bottom of it which says that uh, a freshly laid egg uh, will hard boil in this drink, which I would like to test. Um, so, we, as like I said, we're going to make it slightly differently. Uh, we are going to add two dashes of absinthe um, and also two dashes of Angostura bitters. So, we're going to make it more like um, an old fashioned twist, essentially. Uh, so we're going to use 10 mil of sugar syrup, uh, one to one, and finally we're going to use 60 mil of the Glamourangi Quinta Rubin. Um, Glamourangi Quinta Rubin, it, it took a lot of scotches basically um, to figure out which would be the right one for the drink. I know, like, they do us drinking lots of scotch. Uh, but Glamourangi uh, just works super, super well. So Glamourangi's Quinta Rubin, the Quinta Rubin, uh, is finished in port casks, and there's something in um, that whiskey with the absinthe, with the Angostura bitters, which gives, which gives a lovely kind of like mocha, um, cocoa nib kind of flavor to it. Um, I don't know the exact science of it, but it's pretty good. Cool. Um, so, as an old fashioned, give it a good stir. That's And that's the choker. 